Next question, Mr. Fontes. Would you not agree with me that it is possible to rescue a, di a, di uh, a diver from a pipeline that is 30 inch in diameter? Diving in pipelines is not a thing. Honestly, it's, divers don't go into pipelines. There's but no task on the installation of pipelines, the repair of pipelines, the inspection of pipelines. There's no task that requires a diver to go inside of a pipeline. All work is done on the outside of the pipeline. I agree with that, Mr. Right? Fontes. So but dive entering a pipeline is not a thing. We do not go inside pipelines. Okay, but suppose there is an accident and a diver ends up inside a pipeline and the question of rescuing that diver arises. Do you think from your experience, if there's a 30 inch diameter pipeline and, a, and the diver is inside that pipeline and there is water in the pipeline, okay? Obviously the, there's water. Let's say the pipe is even filled with water. Do you think that it is possible to rescue a diver from that pipeline? It is possible, whether it is possible. A rescue diver would have had three, thing against, three things against him. It's a penetra three high-risk activities, right? It's, it's a penetration dive, one. Two, into contaminated waters. Three, with the possibility of further delta P. Okay, okay, right? I take that. Okay. So those are the risks that would have to be considered. Major risk, yes. Right. And, and there, there could be a consideration of those risks, and there could be a if it is possible, the dive can take place. With the proper gears and steps, additional steps, safety steps in place, yes. Thank you very much.